In this video, we will show step-by-step -step how to effectively measure and rebuild cylinder bores. This will result in an optimal refurbishment outcome. The cylinder bore is an essential part of every combustion engine. It provides the necessary guidance for both the piston and the piston rings, allowing them to move linearly and freely. A properly manufactured surface of the cylinder bore ensures that all involved components operate smoothly and efficiently. Each engine cylinder undergoes a special processing step before completing the honing process. When essential components such as pistons or piston rings are replaced in the combustion engine, it must be assessed to what extent the cylinder running surface needs to be refurbished. If it shows slight signs of wear and the typical crosshatch pattern is no longer recognizable, we advise renewing the surface and honing structure. If they have been severely damaged by foreign particles or other influences, the cylinder bore should be bored to an oversized and then honed. In both cases, the honing process as the final machining step has a significant impact on the future running in behavior, efficiency and longevity of the engine. Taking a closer look at what happens during engine operation makes it clear why the cylinder bore must have a defined surface structure. The honing process takes place at the microscopic level of the cylinder surfaces. To understand whether the processing at this level has been properly carried out, an inspection with a microscope or a precision instrument must be conducted. It's important to know that this microscopic surface structure can only be conclusively proven through a measuring process. A suitable measuring instrument for an engine rebuilder would be a portable roughness measuring device. A tool capable of measuring and displaying surface texture in the micrometer range. By evaluating the measurements, the key factors regarding the condition and quality of the cylinder running surface can be analyzed and compared. Operating a roughness measuring device is simple. Before measuring, make sure the cylinder bore is clean to obtain reliable measurement results. Dirt or oil could distort the results and damage the measuring device. Carefully place the measuring probe tip in the direction of piston travel on the cylinder running surface. Perform the measurement. During the measurement, the device must be held still. Movement during the measuring process can later have significant impacts on the measurement results. In the measuring process, an industrial diamond tip is guided over a preset measuring distance. The resulting trace forms the basic of the calculated measurement results. The results are displayed on the device's screen, providing an impression of the roughness and structure of the cylinder honing. Additionally, the results can be exported and digitally stored for documentation purposes, as well as further analyzed. If the roughness values deviate from the specifications, this indicates unsuitable condition of the cylinder surfaces. Often cylinder bores that do not meet the required surface parameters can be rescued through reworking. However, attention if a cylinder with a poor bore has been refurbished the cause of the engine damage can be varied. Therefore, if the machining is not carried out properly in advance, this can later lead to serious damage to the engine block. Motor Service, in collaboration with experts from engine production and workshops, has compiled recommended parameters for the aftermarket for guidance. The complete table and additional information material can be found on our website.